Migrating birds usually travel in a V formation when going from one place to another. So in this video we are gonna explain why does birds fly in this format and does it really help them. When a bird flies by flapping its wings instead of just gliding, each downward push by a wing creates a vertical vortex in the air, trailing the bird. The vortex circulates downward on the bird side, outward on its bottom side, upward on its far side and inward on its top side. If a trailing bird positions itself in the up slope part of the vortex, it receives a free lift. It still must flap to stay aloft, but it does not have to flap quite as hard and thus its energy expenditure is not quite as much. So the savings can be significant over a long journey. To be in the upflow, a trailing bird should be off to one side of a leading bird. And a V formation is one of the best formations for placing the birds properly. Although the front bird experiences some of the upflow from the birds just to the left and right of it, the lead position is usually the most tiring. Probably many of the birds in a flock take turns as a leader. So that's why birds actually travel in V formation during long journeys. So if we talk about fish, energy savings can also be one reason why fish swim in schools. The vortex formations by the leading fish can help reduce the energy requirements of fish farther back in the school.